how's it looking for the weekend? Not too bad at all, Lou. And a beautiful sunrise to start the day today, but it was pretty chilly. Temperatures at Santon Downham on the Norfolk Suffolk border fell down to one degree Celsius. A grass frost recorded here and at Wattersham, Rothamsted and Rittle. But it will be turning milder over the weekend and it should be largely dry. But this afternoon we are expecting some showers to feed down from the northwest. Won't be for all of us. There'll be quite a lot of fine and dry weather out there. Fairly cloudy skies, but some brightness and sunshine too. And highs of around 12 to 14 Celsius with mainly westerly winds that will be quite blustery at times, but it won't be as windy as yesterday. And then through this evening, those showers should clear away and a lot of tonight should be dry. There'll be quite a lot of cloud, but under clear skies again, it's going to be chilly. Temperatures down to one or two degrees Celsius in some spots. So again, a frost in places and some mist and fog too. And then on Saturday, still looks like we're going to get these southerly winds dragging in milder air and it is looking largely dry. Again, quite a lot of cloud, but hopefully some brightness and sunshine at times and perhaps the thickest of that cloud producing an odd isolated shower. Temperatures close to average, around 13 or 14 Celsius at best, with light southwesterly winds. And then on Sunday, we've got this front pushing towards us from the west, but it will be weakening all the time. So it now looks like Sunday will also be largely fine and dry with just a few showers. And I've taken the showers off on Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday too. We're probably going to see a few, but for most of us, the fine and dry weather continuing into the middle, perhaps even the end of next week, Lou.